Hey trainers, Pope Dad here. Along beside me is the artist formerly known as KK Shrimp on Twitter. And today we're going to take a look at uh, Glaceon Barbacle. We're going to do a little testing with it. I showed off the list uh, a few days ago or so. And looking for the turn one Glaceon, shut off uh, abilities so they can't trade three times in a turn and then Sycamores where they're looking at 13, 15 cards. So we're going to shut that off turn one, hopefully. We're going to do 90 to the active, 30 to the uh, bench, and set up a polar spear. Set up a polar spear if need be, if there's a big threat on the bench. And along with that 30, we're also going to hopefully utilize Po Town, put another 30 on it, and eventually drop him on the bench, attach water energy, devolve, take some uh, knockouts on some Zeroes, Ralts, or possibly even some Rock Ruffs, stuff like that. So, Wimpod. Wimpod. Well, that's 70, so we'd need a little more damage on there, but for the most part, you know, everything except Wimpod and Trubbish should go down to a miraculous shine and strategy behind it is we're going to lock out stadiums using barbacle special energies so no no special energy uh from the opponents can be played and we're going to keep potan we've tried loose uh lucamine in the deck but uh it had kind of mixed feelings on it uh some games we really liked it some games it was just wasn't worth it, because uh, for whatever reason, like if uh, we had Glaceon in the active, then they were struggling to hit a draw supporter to even find a field blower or a counter stadium. So, wouldn't get much value of the Lusamine, so just went with the four. Uh, one tap of Lele. Uh, try to go as, as little of the basic as you can, because you want to start EV. But just in case we don't, we got four float stones, three choice bands. Three Guzmos, three Cynthia, three in, two Sycamore, and one Acerola, two Bridgets. So let's dive into the ladder and uh, see how we do. Pretty sure it's going to at least win one of the games that we play. At yeah. least. It's been doing pretty good in our testing. It's not like the, uh, the Magnum where we've been testing it for five years and it's nowhere near ready. The Magnum? Yeah. Oh. From Zoolander. Yeah, I know what you mean. Shouldn't even be talking about it. It's nowhere near ready. <laughs> and we lost the flip. You always go head with, heads with the world's coins. Do you? Yeah. Okay, so we just need an energy. We have in. What is there? So let's do that. I do not want to bench Espeon. I don't want them to know our strategy just yet. Okay, Ralts. So, we're going to be looking to spread some damage and definitely devolve. And get Potown. And Potown, lock them out. They might be running one parallel city and maybe two fill blowers. Okay, so he had a really good start. Um, see, this is this is awkward. This is why I don't really like running Bridget. I think Troy spam the active and then in. I think yeah, I think we in and try to hit water. Oh, uh, this could be a fail, but let's go for it. Gotta hit the water. We got the water. We got DC. We got another EV. Oh, uh, it still may be a fail. So, I don't... Yeah, our third Glaceon is prized. Let's find out. Oh, it's there. Right. What else we got? We got our 2-2 two -two two Barbacle. We got our Espeon. One Lele. We prize the Rumor Raid and Artillery. We got three Aquapet. We got a Rescue Stretcher. One Potown. One Potown. Um, one Guzma's prized. One in is No, we played it in. Um, one Float Stone's prized. And, okay. So nothing got, bad prized. Got five out of six. So, 
Let's do that, and then, uh, Uh, yeah, I'm yeah. fine. I'm fine with that. If he wants to gizma it up, that's fine. It's not the end of the world. We don't have a lot going on anyways. It's like he knew we were playing barbecue. Immediately throws that DC down. Yeah. <clears throat> he had a super good hand. He had the artillery. We may see the green kiss for We'll 10. see probably now. We'll probably see rare candy Gardevoir. He might retreat and do a Vulpix. Yep. Yeah, retreat. Okay. So we'll see a beacon. It'd be nice to uh, definitely get an in. Yeah. Wow. He had a really good hand and a good sycamore. Or she, sorry. Wow. Abyssal Hand for four, Secret Spring, no. Oh. Seems like she didn't want a Abyssal Hand. Or did she already? I wish she liked Sycamore. So she's about to get three Gardevoirs set up. We'll probably see Boost Energy or something. Alright, so... Holy... And no Potom. Oh, can't sink or spring because of Glaceon. Alright, so we gotta set up. Bring it down to 200. Uh, that's our best play. I think we're in a bad way. I think. I think she just. Uh, Drew the juice. Yeah, she had the juice. Gardevoir doesn't usually set up that quick but hey play the hand you dealt right there's fairy energy will flow three six nine that's twelve knockout. fifteen eighteen got the choice man that's a knockout that's probably game over And we have no draw supporter. This is probably where we get the draw supporter. Yep, that's game. Alright. Let's hop into another one. The deck's actually good. We're not blowing smoke up your butt. But when Gardevoir sets up that quick, I don't know if any deck can withstand that barrage. Fighting Psychic and Dark. Fighting Psychic Dark. Lucario That's interesting. Zork. Yeah, possibly Lucario Zork. There we go. Yes. No. That's fine. I'd rather take a mulligan and get Eevee than to have, like, Binnacle or Lele or Espeon or something, you know? Yeah. I'd rather give him a mulligan. Yeah. Oh, dear. Remoraid. Or we can just start with something we don't want to. Alright. we got to go in hard with Sycamore. Depends on how many mulligans he takes. Not just one. There's the water. There's the water, but it doesn't do any good. Um, I think we're going hard here. Try to get Eevee and Floatstone and a water. Yeah. Gotta be aggressive. Wow. <sighs> And we have no draw for next turn. Except for the artillery. <sighs> the struggle is real, folks. Triples are a. Uh... <laughs> 
All right, better late than never. I mean, it didn't make a difference really what he did. All right, so let's do that. Let's evolve. One's in the discard. We have rescue stretcher. Let's evolve that. We have, yeah, there, we have Aqua Patch. I don't really have. We do that, that. Bissell Hand for three. <coughs> hmm. Yep, it's retreat and at least shut off their trades and no bloodthirsty eye. Oh, like... Would have been nice to hit a binnacle there. That would have been ideal or another energy. Or a draw supporter. Or a draw supporter, but. I think an energy would have been really good. An energy here, yeah, sets us up very nicely. Okay. We're going to keep our bench small so there's not a threat of a dangerous. Oh. That's beautiful. Alright, so we can Good. target down the rock rough. Uh huh. And just eliminate all his energy on the board. I mean, it's not too much. No, but it's the only thing. Do Bustle. that. Wait, wait, wait. You can bustle hand for one. Okay. We need binnacle. Or two barbicles. That seems just as good. Alright. Frost bullet. There we go. That must have been a hard decision. Putting 30 somewhere. Choice band. Um. He must be wanting to Guzma here. Oh, nope. There we go. Yep. I wonder if he had the Zorks, but he knew there was no point in putting them down. Because he didn't have the draw. So, that one took two super quick games. Let's hop into one more. Yeah. I mean, That's two out of three. I mean, not the ideal start by any means, but made the most of it. Shut off all his abilities. Even Bloodthirsty Eyes wouldn't be able to do nothing. He wouldn't be able to Dangerous Rogue because there's no reason for us to have a huge bench. Water, Normal, and Psychic. I mean, really all we need is maybe a backup Glaceon, one Barbacle, and an Abyssal Hand. An Artillery. That's it. Yeah. So we don't need an absurd amount. That's why we're only playing the one Bridget. Once again, no Eevee start. Um... So we're going to in and hopefully hit float and Eevee. That'll work. That's good. So let's in. Looking for Eevee, float, water. And we got none. You are good. You can. I can hit done. <laughs> Indeed you can. Alright, next turn we can upgrade to Barbacola. Barbacola. We can in. Or we can go in hard with Sycamore. He's playing Lap Lapras. Trash Alanche. Uh, trash or Garbodor? Probably Garbodor. No, nah, because you'd want Don Wings to switch back and forth. Maybe it's a. Uh... Oh, maybe it's, it's, yeah, it's probably Wambolt's, uh, Glaceon, Garbodor with two Lapras. Alright. No more DCs for him. So no more DCs for the Glaceon. Wow. We nearly knocked ourselves out. Yeah, oh. Bad sequence of play. You gotta keep, you should set up Greg first and then, I don't want to, I don't want to end him, he's only got four. I mean, if he was having to go in with Lele, I mean, if he had water, he would have put up Lapras and just played Collect, you know? Yeah. So, I don't want to end. 
So let's just sycamore. It's fine. There's the Eevee. We don't have floatstone. So he's going to knock out our barbacle. That sucks. That's why I would like one enhanced hammer in the deck. So if they already have a DC in play. What's the chance of getting it right now? Um, Alright, so. You think which ball for the um, barrel? I'm wondering if we don't kind of go aggressive here and get some value out of Abyssal Hand and maybe hit Floatstone. Let's check on our float. Let's do that. Let's, uh, let, we're going to dump in. We're going to dump Bridget. We can uh, Cynthia for next turn. Let's take a look how many float stones we have when our chances of hitting it. We've got three. I say go for it. Three float stones. Let's do it. Probably not going to give it to you. But three left and we're drawing three cards. That would be two. I cool. like those odds. So let's do it. Three is the magic number. There it is, oh. folks. All right. Well, so, Lele's still threatening to Glaceon, but I'm yeah. okay. True, you just gonna get blown up. Yeah, but I mean, yeah. we can Guzma up the uh, Lapras. Playing Energy Lotto, he might attach water to Lele just so he does more damage on Glaceon. Yeah, probably. Or discard it. Well, he's running Aqua Patch, so he can use that on his Lapras. Yeah, twenty. Yeah, ninety. So if he adds the water, that's a knockout. So are you gonna Guzma? Yeah, I've got to. I've got to Guzma. Otherwise, Glaceon's taking massive damage here. We gotta get Lapras up in the active. Got a vessel hand for two. Um, how many? Do you remember how many Glaceons are in the deck? I think you have two more. So we could. So I'm thinking maybe Ace Rolla next turn. And put up what? Well, we have our free retreat. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then reattach water, fall to Glaceon. I don't know, either way, we need. I don't know, the play might be to. Oh. Lele's the threat right now, yeah. so. We could put 30 on it and then use our GX attack or 120 and 30, 150. No, we'd have to use our GX attack. So we might need to hit another Guzma. There's the Guzma. Lele's going to come back in the active, I'm sure. He wants his... Uh, DCE's back. DCE's back, and right now... We got one of the... We have the one... The barnacle. One energy. Two energies. The Lele. That's what the game changer is. Yeah, this deck... Enhanced Hammer would definitely help it. Um, I don't want to attach here. I kind of want to ace Arola and just let Octillery take a hit. Yeah, go for it. That doesn't really advance our board state. Let's do it. Because what we're doing right now is not going to work.
Try spinning that. Ultra Ball. Get rid of those. How come you didn't get rid of the water energy? I don't know. I was hoping we had a binnacle. I told you it was price. Oh. I think this was a bad matchup. It is better suited for the mirror match. Yeah. I don't want to touch water. No DCE. Oh, man. Jeez. No, there's absolutely no way of winning it. Oh, he's doing 110. He's two shotting. Glaceon. Even if I did hit DC, Lele is going to win that match. Yeah. Deck needs uh, enhanced hammers, but I don't know what you're going to cut. to make room for it. <laughs> yeah. That's about right. This is what turn five and six. Yeah. Garbador, so no Lele play. I think your only play is the DC, the active Frost Bullet, yeah. and then 30 on the Glaceon. Oh, well, then he's just gonna, uh, let's go that route. And then he takes a knockout. You bring up Glaceon. You hit him for ninety and thirty more. Right? Um, he needs to. He needs to Guzma. Here. No. I think I would Guzma. And get damage on that because that sets up a uh, polar spear. Yeah. Because he, he knocks out our Glaceon, we pull up, we take a knockout, but he's getting Lapras set up. He's, he can't one-shot. He's, he's got too many attackers powered up. He's got Lapras one energy away, he's got Glaceon powered up, he's got Mewtwo powered up. He just, mm. Start powering it up. Mm -hmm. Half 
to. That's 150. We would have had to hit choice band off of no draw. All right. He might come in with Lapras and blow us up right in the face. That's 190 with Lapras. Okay, we have the choice band. Of course, we get the choice band. So. Um. Yeah. So we'll go down to 10 health. That's why I kind of wanted to put the 30 damage here. So we could always GX. But then but then he would just pull up Mewtwo. So it doesn't really matter. He has just too many attackers for us to have an answer. Yeah. Once again, not hitting energy. Story of our life. Interesting that he put up that. I guess the only thing you can do is pull their spear. Hmm. Huh. It's two to two, but this game was not close at all, folks. He could have easily put up Lapras, blown us up, or Mewtwo. Mewtwo would do serious damage. They're just... Mm -mm. Alright. We didn't... Fully showcase what the deck is capable of, but it is good. It needs, it's a little rough around the edges, so it needs a little trimming. Trim some of the fat off. But, we'll continue to work on it and revisit it. Um, I can tell you right now, we need to add enhanced hammers. Just in case, they already have DCs in play. And, I don't think... I think the water's there. The energy's right. Yeah. We just didn't hit it. So I wonder if maybe some adjustments here. Maybe. Maybe like that would be better. Yeah. Um. I'm. You know, Bridget's good in theory, but. A lot of times that doesn't get us to our floatstone EV water. And that's what we're looking for. So I'm not sure if Bridget Nest Ball might be a better option. So that's something we'll have to play around with. Yeah. But I mean, you didn't get to really see it, but the deck is solid. Um, we just didn't get waters like we needed and or energy in general like we needed. And the, the game too was more... Typical of how the matchups go. So, if you're interested in it, give it a try and uh, subscribe to the channel. Hit a like, comment, and tell them be excellent to each other. Party on, dudes.